Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you three really simple hairstyles that make you look polished and put together, but you spend minimal time on them. I'm all about spending minimal time on my hair and making it look fabulous. So if you'd like to see how I got these looks, then please keep watching. By the way, today's video is a collab with the beautiful and talented Sarah Verona, and she is so talented, and look at her, guys. She's just flawless. She has a lot of beauty-related videos on her channel, so go check her out. She'll be linked down below, or you can click on the annotation that'll take you to her channel, and she's also doing three easy hairstyles, so definitely check her out. I really am a huge fan of her work. For look number one, I created this really simple fishtail braid, and... It, it's as easy as it looks. It's just a fishtail braid on the side of your hair. I have a couple little tricks to kind of make this look a little bit different than your normal fishtail braid on the side, so let's jump into the tutorial. First off, I'm starting off by parting my hair into a deep side part. Yep. I have collected a small section on this side of my hair that has most of the hair on it, and I'm just gonna start fishtailing. To fishtail, you basically split your hair into two, and then from each opposite strand, you grab from the outside and pull it to the inside of the other strand, and then you grab from the opposite side and pull it to the inside of the other strand. So you basically repeat that all the way down as long as you want your braid to go. To keep this braid in place without using any hair ties, I'm just gonna back comb the bottom of it, so I'm just back combing that generously, and make sure that you pull it apart to make it nice and big and loose. I find the key to this look is flipping the braid over your head after you've pulled it apart and back combing underneath. So I'm just flipping that over and I'm going to back comb at least three sections underneath that braid to make it look fuller and just make your hair look a lot thicker. And then go through and smooth down that back comb so you don't look like a wild woman. And you are all set with your fishtail braid. For look number two, this is a very simple look. I know it looks a little bit difficult, but it really is so easy. And those stupid hanger strings, I forgot to cut them off my sweater. So yeah, they're hanging out, and I'm sorry about that. To start it off, I'm just going to add some volume to my hair by back combing it. You can make your look as large or as sleek as you want it to. It's really your personal preference. Now I'm just taking a whole half of my hair and twisting it over to the opposite side and then I'm just going to pin it. You should have something that looks like this. And now I'm taking the front section from the opposite side and I'm going to twist that over and I'm just going to kind of connect the two with a bobby pin. Now for this part you can make it as wild or as chic as you wanted to. I'm basically just taking pieces of my hair and twisting it around my fingers and pinning it. So just take random sections, twist it and roll it up and pin it. And then I'm just like grabbing chunks of random hair and just pinning it to where I think it looks good. So it's really a personal preference. You can make this look really messy and kind of sexy or you can make it really chic and put together. So I kind of made mine in the middle so it was a little bit messy but still chic at the same time. Then pull it apart after you've pinned it so it looks larger and you know kind of shape it the way that you want it to look. Look number three is like the most simple look ever, but it's really so polished and chic looking. I've been doing this a lot lately because I'm so lazy, I don't want to curl my hair like I usually do. So I've been doing this very, very often with my hair. Take out that flat iron and flat iron your hair so it's nice and chic and straight. I did a side part this time, but sometimes I also do it in the middle, so I just, I was feeling it today. So we did a side part, and now I'm just taking my comb and parting off a section going straight to the top of my ear, and I'm going to put the rest of my hair behind my head and clip it out of the way. Go ahead and repeat that on the opposite side, and pin that back hair up so it's just out of the way. I'm spraying the front part of my bangs with hairspray so we can really just comb it down and make it look nice and chic without any little flyaways. And that will make it look just nice and shiny and neat. Go ahead and take both of the front sections of your hair and put them behind your head and tie them together with a hair tie. This way you don't have to worry about bobby pins poking you on the head all day and all that jazz. 
You can either leave it sleek or add a little volume. I decided to add a little volume just because I like my big hair. So I'm just back combing the top of my hair and then combing it down to smooth it afterwards. So those are some of my favorite hairstyles to do when I'm just being lazy and don't want to do anything to my hair. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to y'all next time. Bye!